How's it going, everyone? Today, we're all in snow out of uh, one of our commercial accounts. There isn't really a lot of good room here in the parking lot to put it while we're plowing. So we normally pile it kind of in this one particular location you'll see here in a minute. And then once it builds up a bunch, haul it around back here and dump it where you can see we're dumping here um, and put, push it out into this retention pond where it can melt and not bother anyone in the spring. I recently got a drone, the DJI Mini 3. It's been fun uh, to get a kind of, it gives you a whole kind of whole new perspective, gives you a different angle. A lot easier for me to get good shots instead of just running around with my iPhone on the ground. So that's been kind of fun. The one drawback is it doesn't have audio. So I don't know if I can, if I might try like hook a mic to the machine or something out there to get like real life audio. Um, but otherwise you got to hear my voice or some chintzy song I find for free on the YouTube app. <laughs> it's hard to get good music and not get a copyright strike if um, you make YouTube videos, you know what I mean. Anyway, uh, yeah, so here it is, loader. It's our DL250 loading our Peterbilt 389. Um, running around in the back, our Western Star will show up here shortly. Um, I know a lot of guys like to pile snow like way up over the box because obviously Ken doesn't weigh anything, but we don't, we don't like to make a big mess everywhere we're driving out on the road and stuff, so we just kind of fill them up as much as we can without spilling over it. We're only going across the property, so if we have to haul one more load or so and not spill everywhere, that's how we like to do it, so... Here's the cat 289 pushing out over this pond. Uh, is it actually driving on like 20 feet of snow right here, 15 feet of snow? But it's there's a lot of frozen chunks and stuff, so it's actually holding up the skid pretty good. I was hoping the skid wouldn't sink in and get stuck way out there in the middle, but it didn't, so that was nice. Right now, I think it's about, we're doing this video, it's about 9 p.m. There's still a few cars in the lot, but it's not bad. It closes at about, I think, 10, so right there, I just hit a tree. Um, I've crashed this drone about six times, and so far, it still hasn't broke, so that's pretty cool. So when something actually does break, which I'm sure it will eventually, I'll let you guys know. But let me know in the comments below what kind of content you'd like to see. You like these kind of videos uh, with like a voiceover, kind of like I do on this one. Or if you like to see kind of all different angles, talking to the guys. I mean, there's a million different videos I can make on a million different topics. If I know kind of what you guys want to see and if it's something I feel like I'd be interested in. I've always just made videos on kind of whatever I felt like making, whatever I thought was cool. I've never had an agenda. I've never had anyone to really please with them. So I've kind of just made whatever I wanted whenever I wanted to, which has been kind of fun. That's kind of nice to be able to just be creative and do what you feel like. So that's that. That's kind of what this channel has been. So honestly, never thought it would develop into what it has when I started it. Originally, I spent about $1,000 on a camera now that I don't even use. And my goal was to make a thousand bucks back from the channel uh, to pay for the camera, which I have done by now. And I don't really have a like really like a strict like list of like goals of what I want to do with this channel. Honestly, I kind of just make videos of like I like doing it. I like shooting the video. I like editing. It's a lot of fun. It's kind of like a hobby. Like I enjoy it, but I don't really have like a like an end goal. But nothing to like really like really like you know like dedicated like really thinking they want to do with this channel i guess just to have fun with it and i have met a ton of people through it uh over the years which has been fun it's been really beneficial for our business we've gotten work from it employees customers so that part is nice um and it doesn't really cost me anything to make these other than my time my wonderful wife did buy me this drone for my birthday so that's kind of cool um it's been a lot of fun using this otherwise i just film with my iphone and edit with iMovie <laughs> like I don't have any fancy editing software or anything I just do it in my spare time and that's that so yeah I'm, I could go on forever but um maybe I'll just play a song for the rest of this video but I hope you guys enjoyed drop a comment below um I don't like to be that guy but like and subscribe if you'd like uh, I guess I was just that guy so never mind <laughs> all right guys I uh, hope you enjoyed this video uh, again comment below what you'd like to see what you thought of this video um and as always, thanks so much for watching. Remember, it is what you make it to be.